We met, interestingly, and sort of humorously, online. Um, not in a formal dating app setting. Um, I had been following your ex-boyfriend on Instagram. There we go. He's a photographer. And she showed up in one of his photos, uh, you know, for good reason. And Neve being an internet sleuth, you know. <laughs> yeah, well, he, I can't to, not, yeah. he can't not do uh, internet exploration. He has to. He has to get down yeah, to the bottom of everything. Girl. Come on. Yeah. Who is this woman? Who is this lady? So I, <laughs> I you know, started following her and very gently liking photos here and there <laughs> so as not to appear. Gently, is that like one out of three? Yeah. Is this one out of four? Coach yeah, us up. Something oh. like one out of five, maybe one out of five. And the humor was not lost on me that my friend had had like a big crush on him too. Yeah, yeah. Like I thought it was funny. So I followed him back at some point, but he didn't notice. I didn't know because I have my, you know, I don't, you know, okay, so the only, the only alert I get is when someone I follow mm. comments on my pics. Because otherwise, if my friends say something funny, I'll miss it. Right. So it's nice to see, you know, who, okay. So <laughs> I post a photo of, uh, I got a cool old motor, a dirt bike, motorcycle, um, and I post a picture of it. And the next morning I wake up to a notification that says El Pigo commented on your picture. And I didn't even know she was following me. So I was like, whoa, cool. It was a super work-related, though. I, was, I work in advertising, <laughs> and I needed a motorcycle for a shoot. And I was like, something like this. So like, she, just, she, had just, she had just tagged two people in the comments so that they would see it as a reference. Mm. So it wasn't like, whatever. It was all nice, I needed. Nice bike. I, right. Let's go for a ride. Nothing like that. No, no. Right. No, exactly. So I immediately, knowing that she followed me, that means I can slide into the DM. So I... <laughs> So I, I wonder, honestly, I wonder how many girls you've done this to. Never. He was such First, a player. Obviously. He was so, so smooth. So I just wrote, want to go for a ride. And she wrote back, ha, duh. <laughs> so right away I was like, okay, it's cool, it's, it's cool. And then I said, and I was, I don't know why, I was feeling saucy. I just said, tonight. Because <laughs> I don't know, I, just, I, was, I think I was leaving town the next day. And so I was like, go. I got to take this girl out tonight. Yeah. And she, Are we going to share I think this we part? And she wrote back. Oh, no. Something that... This is true. This is totally true. I could show you I was you wearing a dress at work that you couldn't wear, like, appropriate undergarments with. Okay. So her response, which, like a cartoon... St I, I've never... Had, can I stand up and do this? Of course, please. Like a cartoon. I, I was walking in the locker room at the gym, and I, it stopped me in my track. Like, I didn't know that was a thing. Like, it stopped me in my tracks, and my jaw was like... I've never, I really didn't know that happened in real well, because life. Because he was like, I'll pick you up from work. And I was like, that's not going to work no, no, for no, me. No, I'm no, like, no, 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 hold on. I, I said, want to go for a ride? You said, ha, duh. I said, tonight. And your response was, but I wore a dress to work with no panties. <laughs> <laughs> and I just was like, I'm in love. I'm in love. <laughs> so then we continued to work out the details, which ended up with me buying a pair of underwear <laughs> that I chose to match my motorcycle. It matched his motorcycle. And bringing them to her and handing them to her Amazing. before, like, when first thing I did was I handed her a pair of underwear. I love and, that. And then I took them back. And then, <laughs> and then the rest is history. See,